So I'm out in a service call for no air conditioning. Um, the homeowners were basically telling me that every time they tried to kick on AC, it tripped the breaker uh, inside the house. And basically got out here, they had another company look at it and the company just said, replace the system. Um, but they didn't remember what the people had actually written up. So I'm basically, with the information they told me, kind of led me to think that it most likely is a bad compressor and it's tripping the breaker. It's probably short to ground or internally shorted out. Um, so I pulled apart um, the, the, the common run and start windings going to the compressor and I set my meter to ohms. And first I checked it to ground just to see if it was short to ground. Um, it had no continuity between any of the leads to ground, so um, did not have a short to ground. Um, tried it in between each leg and found I have no continuity, so the compressor is internally shorted out. Um, so I will probably talk to them about either doing a compressor change out, if that's the route they want to go, or possibly, since this is a 410A system, um, maybe getting away with just doing the outdoor just replacing the whole outdoor condensing unit. Um, probably would give them a few options, either doing a compressor change out, just the outdoor unit, or possibly the whole system. Uh, it's kind of that borderline where it's not new, but not crazy, crazy old. I think it's like around 12 or 13 years old. So, I um, mean, it's getting in that ballpark of being in the lifespan. So that's what I'm seeing. Um, it's pretty simple, quick diagnostics. If they do do the compressor, I'm going to do compressor and all the start components, um, run capacitors, contactors, all that, just to kind of do it all at once, um, and filter dryer and all that kind of stuff. So, um, but yeah, that's everything. Pretty simple, straightforward call. Uh, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And thank you guys for watching.